Wedding week marches on here on Twin Cities Live. We're getting you some incredible deals on yeah. wedding essentials. Yesterday's deal was crazy. Today, more crazy deals. Today, I am taking you to Woodbury, where no matter what style of wedding you're planning, this team of a mom and two daughters, who are just darling, by the way, will help you say yes to the dress. We are at Raffinay Bridal in Woodbury, and this just makes me want to get married all over again. <laughs> Hi, Jamie. Hi. How are you? Great. How are you? Just great. Your store is so gorgeous, and I love that you are working with some pretty special ladies. Tell me about this place and, and who runs it with you. Yeah, it's myself, mom, and sister that all own the store together. And we just kind of all came together with our talents to make it happen. We're going to show off some different looks for different styles of weddings mm -hmm. today because that's probably what you have to do is kind of get right. to know the bride and what is she envisioning for her day and how can her look reflect that. Absolutely. So the first type of wedding, we're going with sort of that rustic chic mm -hmm. look. Tell me about that. Describe rustic chic for me. So a rustic chic would be perfect for the bride that wants to do the barn wedding, kind of have some cowboy boots with her dress. We're seeing a lot of just really nice matte laces with that for this season. Okay, let's bring out our bride. Oh, so beautiful. So this is that lace look. Mm -hmm. This is gorgeous. Yeah, so we have her in a Essence of Australia all lace. Um, what we're kind of seeing here is a little bit of a trend with a honeycomb just to really bring out the shape and the integrity of the lace, make it a little something different. But just really finishes with a pretty sweetheart. Again, perfect for that outdoor barn feel. You know, a little more on the vintage side as well. It is really, really pretty. And if there's one day to wear all over head to toe mm -hmm. lace, it's your wedding day, Absolutely. sister. Yes. So then talk about the wedding party. So the groom, yeah. this gray and navy mm -hmm. feels like super elegant, but yes. still really approachable. Yep, definitely. So still a very classic look, very clean look, but having the guys in more of a gray tone instead of the black, just kind of tones everything down a little bit, just really mixes well with the outdoor kind of a feel with the coloring, with the setting. Navy always pairs really beautiful for that kind of outdoor feel as well. And then if you're doing more of the chic with, you know, with the cowboy boots, to have a short dress for the bridesmaids to really show off the fun boots. And um, we're seeing a lot of really fun high sheer necklines to just kind of finish off the detail. All right, our next wedding is a super elegant black tie affair. Tell me yes. what you're picturing for this type of wedding, Jamie. Be perfect for the downtown feel, um, great for New Year's Eve. What's really unique about this wedding dress in particular is it's done in a Mikado material. Okay, what does that mean? Um, it's a newer material, it's kind of replacing the satin look. Oh. So it's a little bit more matte, much more durable, so for better movement all day long. And the back is a big thing yes. for brides, and this dress really has a big wow factor with yes. the back. Yes, big wow factor with the back. It's uh, fully beaded with a partial illusion, the buttons all the way down the train. Um, it just really drapes beautifully, and it can just be worn really on any bride. I love this. And then the guys, mm -hmm. classic black tux, yes. just looking money. Yep. Very sharp, very sophisticated. They'll look back a hundred years <laughs> from now and still think that that look is in exactly. Style. Yes, but we timeless. are missing our maid of honor, Jamie. Well, our maid of honor. honor. <laughs> Here she is. So this is such a fun bridesmaid yes, look for a, a black tie wedding. Yep, you have your full matte sequins. It just really kicks it up, gives it a really elegant feel, but still very classic. What we're loving about this dress too is the back in general. It just has really fun detail with the little swoop. Um, I mean, who wouldn't feel great in this? Yeah, this is a great <laughs> dress. This is one of those dresses that I feel like no matter what point in your life you're at, you had a baby, yes. you're having a baby, yep. you're going to look great in this. And a lot of bridesmaids yep. have to think about that kind Absolutely. of stuff. Absolutely, yes. All right, our final wedding of the day is all about pinspiration, Jamie. Yes. This is where we're seeing a lot of these trends and yes. pastels are yes. big, right? Absolutely. Okay, so yes. tell me about this look with these bridesmaids. Yes, so with the bridesmaids right now, with your very Pinterest-like wedding, we're seeing a lot of the mix and match with your pastels, specifically the lighter, more pink, blushier tones. Now, let's see the bride, though. <laughs> this is where yes. things really pop. <laughs> Take a look at this. Mm -hmm. oh, Gorgeous. Oh, I love it. Yes. So on her, what we're seeing a lot of for that very Pinterest-like wedding is a very free-flowing A-line where you don't have anything very body-hugging, but it still really shows off the shape beautifully, and you just have that really whimsical feel to it. And it's um, nice to have a little bit of the strap, yes, too, because yes. some people, I know, get nervous about pulling up their Absolutely. dress all night. Yes. So the strap is just done very delicate on this so that it's still something but not overpowering. And it finishes with a beautiful sheer back, which we're seeing a lot of too, just to give it a fun little inspiration in the back. And it almost has that sort of like vintage, old school yes. feel mixed in, which is what you really have with the groom that you bring yes. out with the bow tie. Yes, very vintage with the groom, um, but trendy at the same time. 
So we've, um, we're seeing a lot of this really fun, kind of blushier tone for the brides and then pinning, pairing it very well with a navy for the guys. Um, we're seeing a little bit of the, the plaid come back for the men as well. So on here we've shown a plaid bow tie and then a little plaid pocket square. Jamie, this is gorgeous. <laughs> thank you so much. Yes, Hopefully thank this you. gives you some fabulous wedding inspiration. Oh, yes. We and hope so. uh, let's, you know, we should all get married at least once a year. I think so, right? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they were so cute. Big thanks to intern Alex, who yeah, is our, our lovely model. model. Oh, she cool. looks fantastic. I said her mom is watching crying Weeping right now. Right now. <laughs> Sorry, mom. She's not ready to get married. She's too young. Hey, we have a fantastic deal for you. Go to TwinCitiesLive.com and click on deals so that you can pick up a $1,000 gift certificate to Raffine Bridal for just $500. Smokes. Right there. Big thanks to Raffine Bridal and Formal Aware for sponsoring Twin Cities Live. I don't know why I just yelled smokes. <laughs> I'm sorry if that was distracting. That was a good deal.